look at my desk real quick all right i just want you to see the freaking mess oh why do i have polynesian sauce okay this this is just we're gonna get into a lot today i promise <laughs> Y'all, I've been trying so hard, like, I would say pretty much this entire break to try and find another intro that's not, hey y'all, or what's up, or something like that, because I feel like every YouTuber says that, and I want to say something else, but like, how many different ways can you just say hi? You know, maybe I should just start talking off the rip like baby do, because... I don't know, like, I could be like, yeah, but then sometimes I'm not always in a yeah mood. You know what I'm saying? Like, then I wasn't feeling it. But then, you be like, hey. <laughs> Hi. Nah, it's gonna get annoying too quick. Dumb quick. I'ma just go off the rip, you. this mop head that you've been subjected to look into for the past like minute y'all so i woke up this morning i was like okay this twist out i've had it for five days now if you haven't seen that video go watch my twist out video right now so you can get the perfect twist out that'll last you like dang near a week so i decided why not do a hair styling styles that you could do in quarantine just to be cute just to take selfies so you have some content for your timeline so i don't know how many hairstyles i'm about to do but we just gonna jump in all right so boom i'm not even gonna lie to you this first hairstyle is kind of a scam because it's just pretty much just rejuvenating your hair <laughs> it's not gonna be as tight or as you know nice as the regular twist out people might think it's just kind of your natural curls because it's a little bit nappy at this point but it's okay you're just taking some oil taking some water rejuvenating the curls making them look nice so you don't look like a bum out the house now, if you have medium to short hair, you might require some water or some, you know, detangler in a couple of these hairstyles because it gets rough. And I trust me, I feel you, my medium length transitioning haired friends, okay? So you're just going to take a nice scrunchy band. Um, these ones should not have rubber bands in the middle. It's better for your hair. They're also softer. I like the ones that I use. I will try and find a link to where you can get some, typically the beauty supply. But you're just going to go for a nice little curly bang and bun here. Not trying to look too young, not trying to look too grown put your baby hairs down and you just go you know make it cute put some of the bangs up just make it yours After you ever so carefully just took that scrunchie out your hair now this third style is gonna be a kind of other play on a curly bang we're gonna do two puff balls with the curly bang but I just want the defined hairs out so I'm gonna go through in the front and see which one's the best kind of make my own pattern so it doesn't look a mess you feel me you feel me you made yourself a nice little semi-perfect part you just gonna boom put that thing away like this right here now split your hair down the middle get you two scrunchies spray some water if you need it honey and you just gonna split it straight down the middle boom or whatever kind of pattern you want i'm taking my kinky curly knot today because my hair is semi-moisturized not for real so i'm just gonna run it through real quick
that you got two nice little puff balls like this here you're gonna ever so kindly take those bangs out the clip and <laughs> look at you gorgeous need some more conditioner or curly products so that you can make some of your curls more defined go ahead and put that on there now and then you can just go ahead and get selfie ready sis I know clips are the thing nowadays, so you're just going to take your bang, you know, take a soft brush, comb it out, and you're just going to put a nice little cute clip there, whichever one you want, boss, pearls, cutely, curly, cutie, whatever the clips say, and you're just going to pin it back, put you some nice little baby hairs, and get active. Here, I was just trying to be creative and do something different. So you're going to start, put whatever kind of part that you want, wide enough for some bobby pins to fit there, and just section it off while you make the rest of your hair all nice and smooth with some edge control. Now go ahead and put that into in a medium to low, however, whenever... I don't even know what it is put it wherever you want the bun as far as you could put it now you're gonna twist this up put a rubber band around it just so that you can see the defined parts now you don't have to do this but I just want the parts to be defined so if you're gonna do the hairstyle like me then define the parts Now you're gonna go in your beauty box and find you some nice colorful bobby pins or you're gonna go to the beauty supply and get some that match your outfit just so that you can have fun and play around with them and you're just gonna make whatever kind of pattern you want I'm gonna do two X's in the little square part that I partitioned for myself earlier in the video You're gonna get another stronger band scrunchy hair tie whatever you call it and just bring the hair together so it just flows seamlessly through and smooth everything down make sure nothing's out of place pool Now that you've got your whatever pattern with your bobby pins you looking all nice and cute you're gonna smooth out your baby hairs and as you can see I've switched mine up every time I've switched the style because I just don't believe in using the same baby hairs for every hairstyle like that should be illegal or something it just doesn't go all the time you know Here's a hairstyle for whatever reason did not record, but you're just gonna take two of your curls or coils in the front that are well defined, leave them out, put the rest of your hair in a top bun, and then you're gonna get you some chopsticks and put it in your bun just to pop. <laughs> Now 
In this style, my SD card just decided it wanted to be full for whatever reason, but whatever. So the basic of this one is to take three diagonal parts up the side of your hair and twist them upwards. And when you're done, you're just going to put a nice cute little clip and have you kind of an afro-ish thing going on. Just stick with me and you'll see. All in all, we've got seven adorable hairstyles for you to do at home with your 3C4A medium length to short length or transitioning curly hair. Make sure that you like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, share with a friend, do all of that. Make sure you follow all of my other socials and definitely talk to me in the comments. Let me know what else you want to see. If you want me to do another one, if you want me to try colors, anything. I love y'all and I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.